hey guys, I was sent this by the company and given compensation for it. So this just isn't any old security camera. It's got some really cool features. So we're gonna unbox this and get into them. All right, so now that everything's unpacked here, comes with the little mounting bracket and kind of kit here. That's if you want to, you can either have it how it is now, or you can put it upside down, mount it anywhere to the roof, ceiling, any kind of which way you want to put it, or you can just have it like this as it is. It also comes with its own power block. I have it plugged into another one, but use this one if you need it. And then it has your little quick start guide here. So looking at it now, sorry for the little angle here, but it's on, it tells you a little display here. So if you can see the video part here. So if you're calling someone, this is where their face would pop up for video calling. And it gives you the date, gives you the time, uh, temperature and precipitation there. And here's a really cool feature. It's got two lenses, so it's the dual lens feature. And if you can see right here, this little call button. So I'll show you that in a bit, but it's a one touch calling and it'll call the other person, which would probably be yourself. Um, if your kids want to use this or someone in another room wants to use this, get a hold of you, they can just press the button or use a little hand gesture with the okay symbol. And then that'll give a call and I'll show you the app right now. So right here, when you get into the app, I've already set everything up. Um, so you can see here, this is the camera we got and it's recording the top of it and it's recording the bottom here. So that'd be this lens at the bottom. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that, bring it up, and it load in. And then, so there's HD, there's also standard def that you can switch it to for the different resolution. We'll keep it in HD. Same with the top, do the same thing, it's in HD. And right here at the bottom, you have controls that pushing them will spin the top around. So that goes 360 degrees, whichever way, all the way around. And then, so if you see the camera here, right here at the top, right now it's facing down, I can move it up or I can move it back down. And then you got your full spin around and everything like that. So it's 360 degrees around and then 108 degrees on the up and down portion of it. So clicking on this little one touch thing here. So we click it. And then that'll pop up here. Um, if I click on it, I won't talk because you'll hear some static feedback. So there you go. I'll just turn down the volume there for a sec. So you can see right on here, the little camera. And on mine, you can also see the camera from here. So there we go. And you can just hang up like that. And another way to call, we just use the OK. There we go. So you gotta get it just right. And it starts calling again, so there you go. And you can do video, voice, or hang up. Those are the really cool features of it. I really like the two-way video calling, see if you have kids or anything and they're in a different room, they can just go over there and call you from it. Or if they're at home and you're away, they can call you from it again. And it's got the human detection. So you can see here the green border. And you can full screen it. So you can see both screens, a little green border shows you that a person's there. So that's pretty much the rundown for the app. You got your fixed screen at the bottom and your rotating camera at the top there. 
So moving that aside, right now, I really like how small it's very lightweight, so you can easily move it around anywhere. And it gives you a nice secure feeling if you're not at home or you wanna watch your pets, um, you wanna watch your kids, anything like that, or your kids need something while you're out, they can quickly just press a button or give a little hand gesture and easily contact you. The top screen is the rotating one and the bottom one gives a nice panoramic view and both in high definition. So once it's powered off, the camera head downward here and right at the top, if you can see that, is the little micro SD slot. So you slide your memory card in there and then you're good to go. So you can save everything onto there and it's super useful. So I hope you liked this video guys. Enjoy. I really love this camera and I'm sure you are too. Thank you for joining us today on Max Production. I hope you found this review insightful and informative. If you did, please consider subscribing, hitting that like button, and turning on notifications so you don't miss out on future reviews. As always, for more details on the products featured in this video, check the description down below. Your support means a lot, and I can't wait to see you in the next one.